at is a crash that's blocking multiple lanes on 71 South, right near West 130th Street. You can see we have crews already on scene, police cars, fire trucks, and ambulance. be blocking right over by Bel Air Road. And again, this is a southbound lane through Lindale. So you typically head this way, you're going to be running into speeds of just around 10 miles per hour and even slower for a couple of miles all the way back by West 117th. But of course, it's not the only issue that we have with all the slick conditions. I want to bring you through the rest of Northeast Ohio, checking in with downtown Cleveland near Chester Avenue for the westbound lanes of 90. Still seeing our usual rush hour traffic go even slower now because of those slick conditions. And of course, with all the kickback from the cars that are in front of you, it's just going to wreak havoc on your windshield. And of course, you should already know that when your wipers are on, your headlights also have to be on. 90 Hermitage in Lake County was seeing some pretty slow conditions here too. Again, pretty slow, but you have a lot going on there. And this is gonna be causing your drive to be delayed at least 15 minutes, no matter where you're going, just because of the dreary conditions there. 90 in West Wilbur, I wanna bring you over to the west side, seeing similar issues here, potential for ponding, of course, for all these areas. 271 in Chagrin, seeing traffic move along quite smoothly despite the conditions, but of course, 480 Warrensville Center Road, the further we get to the heart of rush hour, the closer we're going to get in terms of the traffic and all of the bunch of backups that you're going to see here, and of course, 77 and the Turnpike, and also in Summit County.